Here's a very nice version of one of those flip-flop things that I like so much. They use them so much for advertisement, and this is a very nice way of doing it, because it's shaped like a house, and it's showing a house, because it's got that lovely chimney at the top and so on. And when you turn it inside out, well, what happens when you turn your house inside out? You get the interior coming out, don't you? So let's do a bit of flip-flopping. Flip-flop and flopping there. We have got a bit of something there on the outside, but the interesting bit is the inside where we've got staircases and all sorts of things. Let's see if we can get these in the focus, because this is a very nice version of a brochure, which is showing the house inside and outside. Oops, there's it. There we are. Scenes from inside the house. And then we'll flip flop again a bit more, top and bottom to get back to the original version. Well, I like that, that's a sort of twin twin house effect, which is very nice, but uh, to finish it, you start as you began there, with the back of the house there, and the front of the house there, and the whole thing is house-shaped. Very intelligent use of that particular thing, and they are so inventive, the people who want to advertise things, using this particular gadget. I think it's a lovely one, yeah? There's a nice ballpoint pen here I've got, which I've had for some time, but never realized what a nice thing it is, because when you put some, it's battery powered, when you put batteries in it, this projects something. I've got to see, it's a bit faint this, but I'll see if I can project on, onto some white paper. It's quite a strong, there we are, there's a light going in the thing, but what's it reflecting? It's actually reflecting a, a Chelsea Football Club slogan, I'm not sure I can get this. We get that close to it there, no, it's out of focus. And it's partly focused, but only partly. It's be a good distance to be focused. It's probably the best we can do. It's, it's what's so nice about it is it's in color, which I is quite a rare normal, it's just a white light, but this is actually a color picture advertising Chelsea Football Club, which I think is brilliant. So, well done the Chelsea football teams. There's something here which I have to wear as a lanyette, which I've never done. I've got to wear one of these around your neck. And on the, in the side of this thing here, we have one of these wonderful creatures. I do love these. Look at the back of it, how intricate it is with all the electronics on display. And this, of course, is one of those display things. It's got buttons there. Oops, there it is. Put it the right way up. Two 2032 batteries which flipped in, and when you switch it on, which is here, uh, here, I think. Let's see what we can get. Oh my goodness me, yes, well, I've got to wear that here, haven't I? Just about here. Absolutely superb. Here it comes. Oh my goodness, that really does identify me, isn't it? Take that to a party, but I'm supposed to wear that inside this on and on yet, and then bring it up to focus. So, a very, very nice version of it, too. I love that. And there's a charming little Indian toy from South America. Well, the South American people, this is, a, this is the Mayan people, actually, of South America. And it's, some, it's a little box which contains them, but I've laid them out. And they've got little figures here, which have got a particular use, which I want to mention. I'll just bring the camera down a bit, so when I tilt it, they don't all fall around a bit too much. Yes. So what it says here, which is very charming, it's a little folk tale. They say, there is a story that when the Maya people of Guatemala have worries, they tell them to the worry people, that's these little creatures I'm showing you, and then put them under their pillow at night time. Let's see if we can get them to focus again. They put them under the pillows at night time, and by morning, the worry people have taken their worries away. Isn't that charming? Very, very nice little version of a of an old folk tale. So, nice stuff. I'm very pleased to get that. And it comes with a charming, genuine little box. It comes from, from South America. Nice stuff. This was 2008. was a very good year for what I call the second best, which is things I hardly ever show. But that's one of them. <laughs>